Hi, it's Richie again. After the aerial shot that we did with the new iPad, uh, we did a few other event-based uh, films, um, including uh, the jet um, going up in the sky and doing some, um, some acrobatics, and also a massive jumbo jet um, from Qantas did a flyby at the, uh, at the Grand Prix as well. We took video of that, and also we took video, obviously, of the Formula One cars themselves. So we'd like to show you all that now, and I thought I'd give you some of my thoughts very quickly on the usage of the camera. First of all, yes, I still felt like a bit of a goose carrying this tablet and using it to take photos. Um, I'm not the biggest of dudes, um, and it did actually strain my, my shoulders to hold it up for that long. Secondly, you couldn't spontaneously uh, move into a camera function. So as opposed to the uh, iPhone 4S, uh, where 5.1 has now upgraded it so that you can just slide up uh, the lock screen, instead here you still have to go through the motions of sliding, uh, choosing the camera, perhaps flicking it across into film mode and then shooting. So there's still a few steps. So what I'd like to see is the next iteration um, of iOS or the next update include a way to be able to quickly get into camera mode. Um, also from a glare point of view, it was a beautiful day so the lens was able to soak up a lot of that natural light and there's some fantastic colours there that you're going to see. Um, but from a glare point of view, when I was holding it up in the sky, I couldn't see a thing on the screen. I was just assuming that the jumbo jet or the uh, jet fighter was actually within my frame. Um, once I played it back, we could see that it was, but a lot of guesswork there. So it wasn't bright enough to be able to see it in all particular situations. However, when we go back and look at the um, footage itself, it looks spectacular. Uh, it really looks good, especially on this screen itself. When I showed it to people and replayed it, they were blown away. So hopefully you'll be too. Again, if you can, change the resolution on your screen to 1080p because that's how we're going to encode it and upload it. And enjoy the show. Until next time. Thank you. 